Attention seniors, a mandatory parent senior night meeting will be happening on February 1st at 6 p.m. It is important that you and your parents show up. Information about grades, attendance, graduation, prom, and the name on your diploma will be presented during this meeting. Attendance recovery has started. If you are in need of attendance hours, please look for the blue sheet located by the cafeteria that has all the hours you need to make up and also what rooms are available to go to. Listen up, Cougars. This information has to deal with your MacBooks. When we send your password on your MacBook, it will go to a screen that looks like this. Please do not type anything in the password field box and then click Forgot My Old Local Password. The next screen that pops up, you will click Reset Password. And 99% of the time, it will be successful. If it is not successful, then a work order for your laptop will need to be submitted. Also, remember to handle your laptop with care. Make sure the case is always on it for protection and keep it close when you carry it around. Listed are the MacBook fees if something goes wrong. Western Hills High School Choir has three All-Staters this year. This is the most All-Staters in a single year for an entire school history. Congra congratulations to Izzy Carroll for second chair at Soprano, Luis Hernandez for third chair tenor, and Sebastian Alonso for sixth chair bass. They will be representing our school in the All-State Choirs at TMEA in San Antonio in February. Soccer season has started and the boys and girls team have been in action on field. Here's a message from both Coach Collins and Coach Grissett. Uh, this is Coach Collins, boys soccer. I just want to invite you guys to come out. We have home game Tuesday against Carter Riverside. It'll be a big one. Uh, JV starts at 6.30. Varsity starts at 8. Um, and we will try to entertain you guys and put on a good show. So uh, come out. The weather's supposed to be nice. So come out and be loud and uh, support the guys. Thank you. Hey, guys. It's Coach Grissett. Um, I'm just here to promote girls soccer and to ask you guys to come out and support us. We are stronger than ever this year. We start district on Friday with Eastern Hills and we would love for you guys to come support us. Um, it's going to be a blast. We love to hear you cheering and it makes all the difference to the girls. So go Cougars! The boys basketball team finished the Bridgeport Holiday Invitational 1-3 over the break and with some competitive games. Congratulations to junior Stefan Holdman for earning an all-tournaments team for his outstanding performance across four games. After the first round of district play, the Cougars stand at 3-3 and currently in fourth place in District 9-4A. The third annual softball fan fest will be on February 3rd from 11 to 3 p.m. Some of the events include team introductions, a raffle with awesome prizes, a hit-a-thon, and finally a varsity softball versus faculty scrimmage. The concession stand will be open with plenty of hot food to keep us warm. The swimmers competed in the District 5-4A to 4A championships last night. Danielle Sherman did best times and got the gold medal in 50 free and 100 free. Diego Flores Martinez got the gold for 500 free and silver in 200 free. And Ethan Schottenkirk got the gold medal for both the 50 free and 100 free. The men's team won the district championship trophy for the second year. Well, well Cougars, that's, that's all we have for you today. today. I'm Xavier Garcia. And I'm Kendall Carroll. And we, we want to wish, wish you a good, good day with, with some great, great news. Go, Go Cougars! Cougars.